I want to move now to another story making headlines this Sunday evening. The ground is now set for a major face-off between the opposition and the ruling class over plans to eject the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission. Whereas Cord is adamant that the IEBC must go, Deputy President William Ruto is accusing the opposition coalition of seeking to destabilize the country. But even as the political class continue to be divided over the issue, IEBC commissioners are calling for sobriety and adherence to the rule of law, as Morimi Wangi now reports. For the past few weeks, the IEBC has been wading in a storm sparked off by a section of the political class calling for its disbandment, a debate that has seen even the clergy call for the removal of the commissioners. The opposition court has called a mass protest that will see them storm and camp at the IEBC headquarters. This threat is the cause of the latest verbal attacks among the political class. Our watu sijui wanasumbuka na IEBC ya nini? Our watu wajipange? We don't want to repeat what EC did right now. So IBC must go home, must have a referee in which we all have confidence. I mean, I do to work here. Take to toy while when you are IBC size, do I kiss into quite elections in Akuja and I say my members in your to the worker to the GWK season members here to a new. But amid the heightened political temperatures, IEBC Commissioner Mohamed Alawi has stamped the onslaught against them as dishonest. He says the move is meant to deem the good deeds of the commission. Election matters a legal process. And where parties are aggrieved, there is a legal procedure within which to follow. If anybody wants to, uh, to address a complaint against a commission or a process uh, through means that are not legal uh, means, then uh, we leave it to them. Wao kama ni wazelendo wa Kenya by Monday wajiuzulu. Last kama si hivyo tunaenda sisi kule tukaulize maswali mtaondoka lini. Kama anataka kwenda IBC atakuta jeshi atakureti market huko. Tusikubali mambo ya mass action kwa ofisi za IBC. Lazima tuchunge mali ya Nairobi. The Speaker of the National Assembly, Justin Muturi, has also added his voice on the issue, asking politicians to go slow on their efforts to kick out the IEBC. And we are capable of stopping this country from going to elections. Now what a good a well-wisher would do is to write a comprehensive letter so that we move from the personality politics of the past and begin to be judged by our institutions so that whether you put a donkey or a horse, the country will run because we have, uh, we, we have solid institutions. Muremi Mwangi, KTN News, in Nairobi.